Welcome back to The Body Coach TV. A few people have been asking me to post a video specifically targeting the abs and core. So here it is, it's my 10 minute abs blaster using some of my favorite exercises. So what we're gonna do is, first one then, just hand on the thighs, little squeeze of the abs for 20 seconds. We're gonna do 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds rest. So the aim here is to really engage these core muscles. Try not to just use your neck. You can support your head if you need to, but really squeeze those abs. Last couple. Good, so we're resting for 10 seconds. So all you're doing is hand in your thighs, exhale as you go up, breathe in on the way down, and exhale all the air out of your abs, okay? So here we go. Focus on the muscles, you squeeze the abs. Good, all the way till that bell goes. And rest, so it's two sets on each one. Next one you're gonna do legs to 90 degrees, hands come behind you, and crunch up and touch the ground in front of you. See, when you really activate them, they fatigue really fast. You've gotta squeeze those abs. And rest good. So remember, you can do fast reps like this and just rock and swing, but you're, you're not really using the abs. So I slow them down. I'd rather do controlled reps and just fast ones. Same again. So I'm breathing in on the way down and then exhaling as I come up and contracting this abs and squeezing my, I'm kind of pulling my chest towards my knees and squeezing my abs. Oh. Right, so next one we're going to do single leg, leg up in the air, and we're going to just do 20 seconds on the right leg, and then 20 seconds on the left leg. So that leg look is in line with my bent knee, so it's activate my lower abs a little bit. Last one. Ooh, ah. Oh, you feel that one. Right, so now left leg up. Again, try not to take it too close to you. Have it a little bit away from you. Engage those abs. And let's go touch that knee on the shin if you can. Really, exhale to come up. Last one. Oh, ah, right, next one is the bicycle crunch, so like this. We're gonna lift both legs up, and then kick away and twist. Off you go, so opposite knee, so opposite elbow. Oh. As a beginner, you can do the same thing, like with one foot on the ground, if that's really too much. That is killing me, that is. Five, four, three, two, one, oh. Okay, so same again, either the full bicycle or the half bicycle. Let's go. Knee to elbow, knee to elbow, kicking away. And again, the slower the better with this one. Really feel those muscles working. Uh, slow it down. Five, four, three, two, Oh. Oh. Okay, next I'm going to do, give our neck a little rest, we're going to do a reverse crunch. So feet hit the ground and then just reverse. So they can rest on the ground a sec and then drive. Oh. So painful. Oh, you've really got to like focus on the muscle using, so really, really contract them. You'll, you'll feel this pain when you get there. You'll know you're using your abs. It's just one. It's a really hard pain to push through, though. Like when you're squatting and bicep curling, that like, you can kind of dig deep with this. Once they go, they go. Oh, 
Three seconds to go. Four, three, two. Ah, ah, right. Ah, can't get up. Right, next one we're going to do is a side pancake. So we're going to do 20 seconds. Just lifting yourself up like this. And I'm going to do the. You can either stay dead still like this, or I'll make it tougher. Little pulses. Ah. So legs together, feet together, and hand in front if you want. Just lift. Lift. Ah. Ah. Right, other side. Same on the right side. Nice straight legs. And lift yourself up. All right, let's go. I don't really often train abs like on their own like this. I kind of do them through my workouts and stuff, but it really, really does help strengthen your core. If you can do this a couple of times a week, I think you'd feel great for it. Right, four seconds. Four, three, two, one. Ah. Okay, we're now going to go onto our front elbows now, and we're going to do an up down plank. Okay, so we go down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up. Good. Keep going. Keeping the abs tight. You should feel them really working now. Down, down, up, up, down, down, up. Last one. And rest, right. 10 second rest. We're going to do that again, and we've got one more to do on the abs to finish this off. Let's go. Down, down, up, up. Down, down, up, up. Down, down. Good. Down, down, up, up. Last few seconds. Okay, now the last one we're going to do is the standard plank on the elbows, except you're going to try and bring your knees like this to your elbows. So let's go. This really hits the obliques on the side of your abs. Three, two, one. Oh, uh, right, one more to go. Final step. This is definitely enough. Last time. One, two, three, four, five. If you can't do that, just can do a normal plank like this. So just hold the plank nice and flat. Squeeze the abs. If you can, progress. Lift those knees up. Ah. So, how long's that? Oh, eight minutes? Oh no. We got two more minutes left, right. Back into the plank. Hold for 20 seconds. I'm off, I've undercut us, haven't I? So hold this. Hold for 20 seconds. Oh, hold it, hold it, hold it. Five, four, three, two, one. Right, rest. Oh, 10 minute abs, come on, nearly there. We're gonna go one more and then one more set on that. Good, so hold, hold. And then we've got one more exercise to do. Final finisher. Squeeze those abs. Nice flat back. Pull your tummy flat up and hold it for five seconds. Four, three, two, one. So the final finisher on your back. Really tough one then. We're gonna do kick away and crunch. So kick away, stretch and crunch. Kick. If that's too intense, just do one leg each time. Oh, last rep. Ah. Right, last 20 seconds, final set on that one. And that is our abs done for the day. So, so kick and stretch, and then up. Stretch, 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 and crunch. It's tight, 
toughest one. My last few seconds. Three, two, hold oh, to finish. Ah, so that is officially 10 minutes. That's our abs workout done. Hope you enjoyed it. Please hit share, tell your friends about it. I'll see you next time on the Body Coach 2. Have a lovely day, everybody.